What's up, Faith Squad? Duh. What's up, Faith Squad? It's your girl back with another video. First and foremost, happy Saturday. Hope you all woke up in good spirits and thank the good Lord for another day. I missed y'all yesterday. I just was just needed a break. I was trying to, you know, be committed to the Vlogtober and I still am. I just missed the day, you know, don't hold it to my heart, hold it to my life. But um, I just wanted to come on here real quick because somebody sent me something special. It was a card and I just touched my heart. I'm not going to put any names on it because that's irrelevant. But I just wanted to come on here because it just really touched my heart to sit and just think about how good you are to people and you don't even realize it. Like how much people really appreciate you and you really don't even realize it. You know, it just feels good to be appreciated. Especially from somebody that you've never met in life and they genuinely just. So I just wanted to come and share that with you guys and just let y'all know that it really uplifted my spirit. And, you know, I know we all go through our things in life or whatever, but no matter what, I try to stay positive and uplifted. And I'm always trying to uplift and encourage somebody else. Those are just big factors in my life you know i just hate to see people down and going through stuff and trials and tribulations and storms even when i'm going through my own trials and tribulations and storms you know i try not to let it be seen and you know that's most of the time usually when y'all won't see me it's because i don't want to bring that to my platform you know what i mean and i just appreciate everybody that does reach out and check on me in the squad you know it just really brings joy to my heart but this person she sent me a card and um she says, Kathy, I know that you've been going through lately and the things have been frustrating, that things have been frustrating for you. I wanted to just thank you for even listening to me then and for caring about how I'm doing, even though I'm not a part of your day today. And that life has kept me from watching YouTube a lot. Just wanted to say thank you and I appreciate you. Love such and such. Well, I just want you to know that I love and appreciate you. I love and appreciate that you can trust me, that you take it in your heart and trust in me to even reach out to vent to. You know, some people don't want to vent out to you because they don't want to feel like they want to put their burdens on you or whatever. Because, you know, they acknowledge that you're going through stuff yourself, you know. So I just appreciate that so much. And that just goes to show that it don't always have to be a financial blessing. It don't always have to involve giving something. It don't always have to involve money. It can just be a simple card, a simple email, a simple text that would just change somebody's whole outlook and brighten somebody's whole day. And I truly, truly appreciate this from her. And it really, really, really means a lot to me. Like so much words can't explain it. I'm not even going to get choked up right now, but I just truly, truly, genuinely appreciate her. And I know she's a good person. We've talked multiple times on occasions just about stuff that we're going through in life and I haven't talked to her as often as we normally do. And, you know, we just, like she said, I just checked on her and seen how she was doing and understand when people don't want to talk or whatever. And like she said, she sees that I'm going through stuff too. And she just appreciates the fact that even though I'm going through what I go through, I still reached out to her and it was just pure and genuine and from my heart, you guys. So that's all. I'm just want everybody to try to be uplifting and encouraging somebody because you just never know. You just never know what you may be going through. I mean, you truly never know what somebody is going through. And you just truly never know how much you can probably change their day. Change, be a, 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 a part of their life that just helps them snap back into reality and let them know that everything going to be all right as long as they keep their faith the size of a mustard seed and trust and believe in God, y'all. We have to keep God first. I don't want to never... On my platform, make it seem like I'm preaching, but I always put God first in my life, y'all, because he's the only person that shows me that if I do trust and put out my faith in him, he will see that everything is all right. You know, he will let you know things that's not right, or he will just, he's just there for me so much and just show me so many different times to never give up, no matter the struggle, no matter the, the, the trials, the tribulations, no matter the hurt, no matter the pain. No matter the things that I go through and I just don't speak upon it. I talk to God about it, y'all. Trust and believe that. And he just lets me know that he's always got my back and always in my corner. So anybody that's going through anything and you want to reach out to somebody and you're afraid to or don't know how to, just do it. Go with your first instinct. You know, just, just check on somebody right now and then from time to time. 
You don't always have to give nothing if you don't have it. You know what I mean? Just trust and believe it deep in your heart. And, you know, just be there for somebody. Be there for somebody else and make somebody else feel uplifted and encourage somebody else. And watch how good it make your spirit feel. You know, whatever it is that you're going through, just by somebody reaching out and showing you that they appreciate you, you might change their whole demeanor. So this is, just wanted to come on here with that quick little say, you know, just let y'all know. And just to keep other people in y'all heart and pray for everybody in. It's the, it's the holiday season. Shut the door and lock it. It's the holiday seasons and, you know, I know some people get down. Get them coats and jackets up. Some people are down during this season. I know I really don't like the holidays because, you know, my family ain't how we're supposed to be. But I still leave it in God's hand, and I love my family near and far. And I know that one day soon God will fix it, and we will be back eating and laughing and crying together like we're supposed to be. But, you know, life is what it is, and you just got to make the best of it no matter what you're going through in life. Y'all want to say hi to Faith Squad real quick? Hi, Faith Squad! I only got my girls here with me. Everybody else is gone, so... I just wanted to come on here real quick, though, and holler at y'all. Let y'all know that I'm still here. I just skipped Blocktober yesterday. Thanks to everybody that reaches out to me and checks up on me and the squad. We love and appreciate y'all so much. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share our videos on y'all social media platform. We greatly appreciate it. And if you already subscribed to the Face Squad and you don't have anything to do on this beautiful, cold Saturday, go back and watch some of our old content, like some, some content that when you know that you subscribe to us that you done probably missed. And check it out, y'all. And just leave some comments and stuff. I've been going back watching old videos and just been laughing and it's been bringing joy to me, y'all. So I would greatly appreciate it. Even my new subscribers, go check out some of our old videos. And leave a comment or something or a heart and let me know that you went and visited some of the old content we love and appreciate y'all so much peace love and blessings y'all please don't forget to uplift and encourage somebody today and who we riding with we, we riding, riding with the angels peace love and blessings <laughs> we out y'all see y'all later